Hi guys, my name is Kayla and I'm just going to share with you a little testimony about how I've been able to see um, the power of God working through others in my life. Um, back at the beginning of summer, I was counseling at a Bible camp and we were playing team games. Um, and the game we were playing was you had to toss this ball back and forth to your other teammates and get it down to the end of a field for you guys to get a point. And so... Um, we were playing and I had this little girl named Alana on my team and um, during the middle of the game she started to look upset and she walked up to the side of the field and she sat down and she started to cry. And so I saw her and I went over and I sat by her and I asked her what was wrong, did she get hurt and she looks at me and she says that she um, feels sad because she's not getting a turn. And they're giving her a chance to hold the ball and she feels left out. And so it's um, it was making her feel sad. And while I was talking to her, she, um, I mean, the activities director saw us and she came over and um, she asked what's wrong. And I told her that she's not getting a turn to play and she feels left out. And the activities director, you know, bends down and says to me, she says, um, you can make that happen. And, you know, immediately after she said those words, um, it just stuck out to me. Um, she said, you can make that happen. So anyway, me and Alana get back up and I help. I say, come on, come on, let's go back out into the field. And so we do. And we start to play around with the ball again. And people are tossing it back and forth. And once I get a chance to, you know, hold the ball in my hands, I, I throw it to Alana. And, you know, she caught it and she smiled and she got to throw it back to somebody else. And... Um, she was able to play and she was able to be part of the team. And so I think sometimes we don't realize how powerful um, our actions are and how powerful our words are and what we say and what we do, how they can make a difference. Kind of like how Ben was saying a couple weeks ago, um, the same power of God and the same love of God that lives in him lives in our hearts too and we have the same ability to do to go out and do and be kind and treat others kindly and you know act in a way that shows God's love and I think sometimes we um, might say to ourselves you know I can't make a difference I can't do this what I say isn't going to change anything and what I do isn't going to make a difference but like it says in Ephesians 3.20, God has the power to do things infinitely more than we could ever dream and imagine. And all it takes is for us just to get out there and just to take that first little step, say the first kind word um, or treat somebody kindly. And God is going to use that to the fullest extent um, in ways that we couldn't even comprehend. So um, I was just really, really, really blessed by that and being able to see that in my life. Um, and I encourage you guys to just be brave and step out of your comfort zone and, um, you know, say a kind word to somebody or treat someone kindly um, in a situation where others wouldn't. Um, and you will bless them and be blessed. Um, I hope you guys have a good week, and I will see you next time.